Vivian Elaine. Today we are going to be talking about Poshmark. So what Poshmark is, is it's an app that you can use to sell those old clothes that just sit in your closet for money. Like, if you're anything like me, y'all, once I wear something, a staple piece anyways, especially if I post a picture on the ground, girl, I'm not going to wear it again. I'm really not going to wear it again. Like, it depends what it is. Something basic, maybe, but... <clears throat> Anything that's memorable, I'm not going to wear it again. So, nine times out of ten, it's just sitting in my closet. And it either goes to the Goodwill or I give it to somebody. But, girl, let me tell you, make some money off of your clothes, okay? Like, you pay a lot of money for that. Or you probably did pay a lot of money for it. Whatever the case is, get compensated for their fees, okay, girl? So, the app that I use is called Poshmark. What Poshmark is, is an easy tool for you to sell your clothes out of your closet online. Very easy, like simple, like literally one, two, three. And it doesn't have to be clothes. You can sell purses, jewelry. Um, It's a lot. Bags. Like, it's a lot of different things that you can sell on Poshmark, honestly. So, what you do is you have to create your Poshmark account first. You go in, you take a picture of the item that you want to sell. When you take a picture of that item that you want to sell, then you're going to go in, you're going to go to your um, to your account, and you're going to upload the picture. So you're going to click the sell um, button, you're going to go to your photos, you're going to click the item that you want to sell, crop your photos, however you want to do that next and then you're going to fill in all the information about the item so this information in particular that i'm going to sell are boots i'm going to put brown suede boots you click done describe it they're, they're literally just brown suede boots i mean you can get as creative as you want because of course when people are googling i mean searching the item they're you know looking for specific stuff so whatever you think people are going to look for that's going to guide them to these shoes that's what you want to put on really simple cutthroat so i'm like you know whatever it is what it is so the category these are women their shoes they are boots they're not heeled boots they're just regular boots so we're just gonna do uh combat and motor boots i don't know what that is but sounds about right <laughs> and the shoe size i wear a size eight the shoe size of that is an eight i don't remember the brand you don't have to know the brand the color they are brown they are not new with tags but if they were new you could put that because a lot of people look for newer items when they're purchasing um, the original price, I believe I paid like $30 for them. And I'm going to sell them for half of that. So $15. So down here, it tells you your earnings when sold. Like, it, ta it takes out the um, the cost for the shipping because the buyer pays that. But you're going to pay Poshmark a little percentage of what you're buying. I mean, what you're selling. So, I mean, that's cool and all because you're still getting money. So, I'm selling them for $15. I give Poshmark $3 and I'm making $12. I do next and you list it and it's that freaking simple so the item today um that we're i'm going to show you how to package is going to be this kate spade watch so okay so this is the watch that i saw last night it's a kate spade smart watch i have the watch i have the owner the book and i have the charger i don't have the box but i mean whatever most people don't want the box anyways if i would have had the box i would have been able to sell it for a little bit more so what you're going to do is you're going to package your item however you want to package it i know a lot of people um use their own like little cute bags and stuff i go and get these priority mail um envelopes from the post office because they're free <laughs> and um i'm just going to drop it in there now usually ideally for something this small you would want to use a smaller envelope but because this is the only thing i have 
this is all I'm going to use, okay? <laughs> because I want to be able to walk in the post office and just drop it off. I don't want to have to package anything when I get in there. So, I just dropped it in here. I may add a little padding if I can, if I can find some, some. But if I can't, then I'm just not. <laughs> Honestly, because, you know, they're going to get the item. And the reason why I get the big priority mail envelope and they have the big boxes as well is because most of my items in my closet that I sell are shoes and, like, dresses. I rarely ever sell jewelry. I think that's my, um, let me see, my first piece of jewelry that I posted. And, y'all, as soon as I posted it, like, she bought it in 10 minutes. It's just that fast. Like, just that fast. So, you're going to need a printer because you're going to have to print the um, the prepaid shipping label. So, once you get the um, the label printed out, I mean, you can print it from... Hopefully, I did not show y'all my address. <laughs> you can either print it um, from your house. You can go to the post office. I mean, the post office. You can go to the library, uh, Kinko's. Like, wherever you can get a printer, just make sure you get this prepaid label printed out. You're going to stick it on the packet tape it to there like so and girl that's it like that's it so yesterday i shipped off an ivy park two piece set and today i'm shipping this i'm shipping off the um the kate spade watch i sold both of those items for like 40 dollars a piece so y'all that is me making ninety dot like a hundred dollars in twenty four hours from stuff that I was just gonna give away for free but I just made a hundred dollars in twenty four hours for something I was gonna give away for free. Easy money easy easy money I love Poshmark um they made everything so user friendly it's not hard and for you to get your money is so easy all you have to do is go over to um all you have to do is go over here to where it has the money sign and then it will show you your credit so you can even you can keep the money in your poshmark account if you like uh purchase any items from poshmark but i'm not a um a poshmark shopper so i don't um i always just go ahead and redeem mine so right here it says pending 90 dollars and 40 cents and that is because it's under pending because i um uh, i just shipped the item off yesterday so they haven't gotten it yet but as soon as they get it they will um uh, it will then move to redeemable and then when that money is green under redeemable that's when you can um deposit that money into your bank account or you can get a check it's totally up to you but i just deposit mine straight into my bank account literally y'all so freaking simple the easiest money making tool that i have done yet because y'all clean out your closet like if you haven't worn that outfit at all in a year you're probably not going to wear it get some money for it like especially if it's a good uh good quality clothes i sell all of my stuff um even stuff that i get from like pretty little thing and forever 20 i mean not forever 21 fashion no but like i sell all that crap because i'm a declutter queen i do not like clutter i do not like clothes just sitting in my closet because i'm not going to wear them and the longer you keep them the more they're going to go out of style so go ahead and just girl make you some money okay okay so that is all for this video i just wanted to show you guys um how i use poshmark and if you've ever used poshmark let me know like i'll go in your closet and you all can shop my closet my closet is at miss vivian that is m-i-s-s-v-i-v-i-a-n thanks for tuning in see you guys in the next video